I went back on TikTok in December of mm. basically last year. Damn. Yeah. Like the so, end of December. It was like after Christmas, actually. Did, I did the, didn't even know. Oh, is that the one? Yeah. You know? Oh, well. so, yeah, for sure. <laughs> the city of Los Angeles is on lockdown. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Lockdown Podcast. Hey, oh. As you can see, I am joined by a special guest today. Keith hey. O'Shea. Hey. <laughs> yeah. What? Well, I, I didn't mean to steal your thunder. I'm sorry. She's a TikTok superstar, mm. custom sneaker designer, Ooh, streamer, mm. gamer, social media coach. What can't she do? The Dang. one, the only, Ariel Lindsay, everybody. Hey. Hey. That was like a lot of hype. You know, you get really gassed me up just now. I mean, that's what I do, girl. Yeah, yeah. you up. Yeah. Sure. We, we break you down to build you up. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thank that's you for right. having me on your podcast. Yes, of course. Thank you for of coming course. on. So let's get the elephant in the room out of the way. Oh. How <laughs> the fuck did you go from zero followers zero. to almost 800,000 on TikTok? I feel like by that's the time this is nuts. uploaded, I really hope. That it's over 800. Let's go. Damn. Over 800. Yeah. Or this is going to be really embarrassing. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be really embarrassing. Also, I was wondering which elephant you were going to dress. I was like, is it the pink hair or what is it going to be? I thought you were going to go with my beard. But that is so, Im- <laughs> oh, <yeah>. so <laughs> impressive. I mean, you have more than like professional athletes, yeah. like actors, oh. actresses. like On TikTok? Yeah. I mean, TikTok is like super. Here comes here comes the humble card. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Here comes okay. the humble brag. Okay. No, I card. was going to say, <laughs> TikTok is just like. It's like a totally different animal. Yeah. I was used to Instagram and Instagram and like I grew fast on Instagram, which like I guess in the world of Instagram, I thought that I did. Yeah. So when I went on to TikTok, also not like intending to grow and just kind of like doing my own thing. Um, yeah, this might not be as like climactic as you wanted it to be. Because <laughs> I'm gonna be like, you know, guys, I just kind of just did me. And then I mean, like- that's pretty badass though. No, but that's the thing that's what makes Oh my god, hello. Don't worry, it's oh, our ma- it's our What in he, God's name <laughs> just happened? He How? torments us. How does he know what? every time, dude? Every time we shoot, he knows and wants to come by and drop yeah. some mail off. So we're gonna make a mail compilation where it's just <laughs> 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 Me too. I was literally like, what animal is it's, in your fucking wall? You don't understand. Wall? We we shot an episode last week at like twelve thirty PM. Yeah. He mail. showed up. It doesn't I matter just, what time it is. Can you just like insert a little clip of what the fuck just happened? So Absolutely. like people can understand. No, we're gonna edit this out. Terrifying. Definitely. Um, but yeah, it's just different. TikTok is like, when I went, it's different now because like after quarantine happened, everyone and their mom got on the app. But yeah. like right before, it was just like refreshing. I was like, it's just different. It's just different than Instagram. Mm. So and, you were on right before quarantine hit? Yeah, like I, it was when I was in South Africa and okay. I just had like time on my hands. I was like chilling with my grandparents and yeah. like my family over there. And I just like started making videos Damn. and I was like, this is fun. But I didn't like really pop off until uh, my first video to hit a million actually was taken down what by TikTok. Fuck? And what was, I was it for? Should we take guesses? It, it wasn't. No, it doesn't even make sense. Why are like, you getting so defensive? <laughs> yeah. <We're just laughs> Relax. We don't work at TikTok, all right? Yeah, it's okay. Hey. Good point. I was just so upset about it. <laughs> all up in your feels. <laughs> Tell us how you really feel, Ariel. I was just, I was upset, guys. I was just really upset. Okay, so That's what brutal, happened? though. You that get sucks. your first yeah. mil, and then... Yeah, I was so hyped. I was like, oh my god, I've never had a million anything, ever. <laughs> and so, like, yeah. it was, like, my first milli video. Mm-hmm. I was super stoked. And then TikTok was like, psych, this is not okay. But what was it? What was it for? It was, Did they tell you why they? It, they just said it violated community guidelines. That's but the they've done that. Be- it is, the but they've out. done that before, and it's like kind of like whatever. Yeah. Where sure. it's like bu- bullshit, basically. But anyways, that's fine. Did you so like did your next video like bounce yeah. back from that or like no. how does that work? Really? So it kind of like yeah. fucked you a little yeah, bit. Yeah, it did. But it's Damn. fine. Like I didn't like think any I wasn't like oh wow I this is like my claim to fame like yeah. a video can go viral and then it's like a video went viral that's sure, it like you sure, have to yeah. continue to like make videos that will go viral so right. yeah. at that point I was just I feel like I just got lucky mm-hmm. and then unlucky because they took it down <laughs> so I was like I guess I should just keep making videos and see what happens and Damn. did you just have like a month where you went from like what 10,000 to like how did it grow like what did it look like um I, it was it was the throwback video, <laughs> which is why, like, now I'm known for that or yeah. whatever. Like, that was, like, the first after that video. Right. That was the first video that, like, 
went vi- for me like viral viral i don't remember yeah. how many i think like it just hit a couple million and it kept going and yeah. like so just a couple million guys don't worry man. so yeah. so for me yeah that was it and then we were like oh this is good we need to make like a sequel to this one so we kept kind of like making these little sketches around that concept yeah and People just liked it. Yeah. So. Okay, That's so awesome. we, we did a little, or we had our intern do a little bit of digging. Oh, God. And so we were curious. We wanted to see what your first TikTok ever was. Oh, yeah, God. We That's... went to the bottom. So oh, That's cringy. But my first oh. TikTok was like a Musical.ly. Oh, that doesn't even count. This, this, this totally really counts. Count. This totally this counts. This totally counts. That's so I mean, it'll get you. Brown hair. Yeah, that was a dance class. Yeah, it's like a baby learning to walk for the first it time. Is. Oh my, look like how cute she is. <laughs> look at it. It's trying. <laughs> what sneakers is am I wearing? That's so embarrassing. Those aren't even Jordans. I don't want to look at it. This is Damn. your program. Yeah, right. <laughs> I know. I'm just going to troll myself. I never forget where you came from. Yeah, that's right. right. <laughs> I know. Started from the bottom. Started from the bottom. Like, those were from Payless. So when you posted this, <laughs> let's see what date this was. This was 2017, almost three years ago. Musically. Damn. It's Okay, what is the difference? That music so, started and then it, was, it went so to TikTok, TikTok right? used to be Musically, mm-hmm. and so yeah, like I remember downloading Musically, making a couple of videos that probably also I took off, like some of the cringy lip syncing ones that like are fast mm-hmm. sped up though. Oh, wait, yeah. it gets worse than this. The first. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you, can you <laughs> scroll one more? You'll see it. Oh, that's not me. Yeah, yeah, we're our intern doesn't. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, what's going on? What kind of production? Oh, I thought it was on like the bottom. Okay. Yeah. Um, and I guess like TikTok bought it or whatever. They changed mm-hmm. it. Yeah. And then one day I noticed that I had this like app that I didn't recognize. And I was like, what is TikTok? Where did Musical.ly go? Yeah. And yeah. then it was like years later because I was like 2017. Wow. I went back on TikTok in December of mm-hmm. basically last year. Damn. Like the so... end of December. It was like after Christmas, actually. Did. I did the didn't even know. Oh, is that the one? To, yeah. You know? oh, well. yeah, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> that was it. That was my first TikTok dance I ever learned. <laughs> okay. So how many TikToks was there and like how long were you doing it before when all of a sudden like you realized, okay, I started getting some traction or so like traction is in like, oh I could do this for a living or as in mm, like No, even slower. So like oh, basically okay. like just like damn, like I'm starting to get like some followers. You know, was it like one video that popped off and then all of a sudden like you know. No, I kind of grew like slowly and consistently mm-hmm. and I like started to develop like a little mini, like a little mini fandom. Yeah. And then um, I started going live, like I started live streaming on TikTok when mm-hmm. I had, I think like 20,000 followers or maybe 15,000. Well, even even <laughs> 15,000. It's hot here, Ryan. You hot? <laughs> it's like, yeah, it's hot. It's really warm. DWP here. cut off the air yeah. to, our, <laughs> <laughs> to, our, to our studio. But so, I mean, well, even 15 thousand and twenty thousand is a lot like was it a grind to get to fifteen thousand and twenty thousand like how was that uh i think yeah it was grind Mm -hmm. it was a grind i mean i it wasn't just like overnight and then i I feel like the longest like the biggest grind was getting to 100k though Mm, for me yeah actually 50k and then after 50k it went pretty fast but it still i felt like the like once i hit 100k i was like it's gonna be faster and for some reason that just took way longer yeah and then after that, like 200, 300 was super fast. Like four, that was super fast. That's and then like 500, yeah. it was kind of like me. And I was like, come on, keep going. Yeah, like, yeah. What happened? What happened? Keep it going. And yeah. then like 600 to 700 was super fast. And now 700 has been pretty slow. It's mm-hmm. so interesting how yeah. it revolves it's around like that. Yeah. Like, yeah it's you'll so, go through like these slumps and then you'll just take off and then slump again. Like, yeah, it's super not interesting. like. I mean, unless I was like Bella Porch or like, well, yeah. or something like that. Yeah, Dude, how, 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 how hot is yeah. Bella Porch? She's fire. I don't know if that was question was directed to them, but she's hot. She's like, like let me tell you. No, yeah, no like, let me tell you how hot this woman <laughs> Speak is. Speak okay? your truth, queen. She yeah. is so hot. I was watching her, you know, amphibi, you know, that yeah, cute yeah, little yeah. video. Okay, and I was like, oh, she's so cute. And you like scroll her TikToks and you're like, oh, like she's got like her big eyeballs and she's like, boop, boop, boop. Yeah. And then you go to her Instagram and you're like, what the fuck? Half naked. Yeah, this girl is a baddie. Yeah, like, yeah. she's fire. Well, that's what's like. I, that's why I've like deleted TikTok and then like redownload it because all because of oh. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm afraid like, like M to the B, I'll, M- watch, yeah. I'll watch a couple like TikToks and think like they're mad funny and yeah. then all of a sudden I'll be like oh wait, wait is this like a 14 year old girl that I'm watching dance oh. yeah. so I saw Bella Porch and I was like oh she's definitely underage like you know, it's cute, definitely the most kid. uncomfortable app to scroll through. yeah because you scroll through Instagram and you pretty much know what you're gonna get yeah. like yeah. for the most part that one's like I, all of a sudden it's like <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's, it's true like, it's true. that it's kid's really eight like, like you're like I should yeah, it's like one. FBI agent like this, well, this was a mistake <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. like I didn't mean to go down this rabbit <laughs> yeah. hole you know and then all of a sudden like yeah it was like oh like 
yeah, I saw Bell Porch for the first time, and I was like, oh, she's a cute kid. And I'm like, that's, you know, but no. She's so cute I kid. back out. <laughs> what was yeah. when I see her Instagram? She's tatted the fuck up. Yeah. She's yeah. like a navy oh. net. Mm-hmm. You know, bat, that I'm is like, a really good, like, description of the apps in themselves, though. Yeah. You know what yeah. I mean? It's like everyone's TikTok is all, like, really know, cute not, and not, happy yeah. and music. And then it's like their IG is just like, I got a fat ass, tats, <laughs> and fucking. <laughs> it's just Rick Ross all day. Like, <laughs> You're so, like, oh, wow, that's a side of you yeah. I didn't know. Yeah. So well, have you noticed, like, your TikTok, as your TikTok followers have gone up, like, that's translated to, like, Instagram and stuff like that? Or, yeah, like, yeah my, how does that work? my Instagram has been growing um, slowly but surely. It's more of an, like, more effort, I feel. Like, I kind of be like, hey, guys, follow me on Instagram. Like, yeah. Yeah, remind yeah. them or hype them up or something. Um, but it has been, like, consistently going up still. I've Instagram. always been interested to know, like, <laughs> the value of a follower per app you know what yeah. i mean like is is a tiktok a hundred thousand the same as uh, instagram no it's 000? not like right. it's interesting because especially now that i'm on both and doing both like i like it's weird where i was excited about 100k but now it's like if you have 100k on tiktok it's actually not that much yeah. like mm-hmm. even if you don't have a million like i know that that sounds so superficial yeah. and shit this yeah. is the world we live in yeah. But, like, <laughs> it's not me. I didn't create this. But yeah. that's just kind of how it is. Where it's yeah. like, yeah. if you have under a million, it's like, yeah, you're, like, a TikToker, but you're, like, not that big of a deal, if mm-hmm. that makes sense. Mm-hmm. Yeah, whereas a million on Instagram is a pretty big deal. Uh, yeah, that's a big deal. Or even, yeah. like, 100K <laughs> on Instagram is like, oh, shit, this person's legit. Like, yeah. even 50K, like, I feel like, I mean, I only have, like, 30-something K on yeah. Instagram. But, you know, I've still been, like making money off of Instagram. Like I was still doing like paid campaigns and stuff on Instagram with mm. such a small number. It's just so interesting where TikTok, well, actually not my first paid campaign. I had like 20,000 followers. So. Yeah. So, I mean, we got to know, like it, you do this, like this is your only job. Like, is this what you do for like a living? Yeah. I do social media for a living. That is That's insane and crazy. wildly impressive. Yeah, might I add. Sure. So I actually had a part, I got a part when I got back from South Africa, I kind of like fucked off for two months. Yeah. Um, and I was like, I need to make some <laughs> so I was like, really? Doing the TikToks is so tiring. <laughs> yeah. It's like, wow, I, this is stressful. So um, I actually came back to Florida and I got a part-time job that I could do from anywhere for like one of my friends' marketing companies. Okay. Um, so it would still be like, you know, revolving around social media. But I was already like making money through social media, through Instagram, actually. Mm-hmm. Um, and and I was also like run a social media manager for like a couple brands. I was kind of doing that where I was doing more social media manager stuff, which now I don't do it all, which I'm super happy not to do it all. Yeah, um, you just get to focus on yourself. Yeah, like yeah. it was just exhausting. Yeah, before it was like I can sell your brand. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Um, I don't watch any TikToks at all. Like Jason Derulo. <laughs> <laughs> and um. What was I saying? Well, now yeah. that you're you're yeah. fully sustainable just through social media. On yeah. Your own. So yeah, I basically ended up like quitting my part. I was like working for. And she's a friend of mine. Like I still whatever. We're still friends and stuff. But sure. I was like, you know, I think Fuck I was. Fuck your job. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I mean, I could work for an hourly wage, or I could do this because I started making money on TikTok. Like in, I guess it was around March or yeah. April. And I just saw the opportunity. It wasn't like I was like, oh, perfect. I can just live and this is great. I, sure. But it was like I saw like how much I could make, by, like what effort I needed to put in to make whatever amount of money. And I was like, yo, or you, you know, make an hourly wage at like a job, which is just going to continue to be that same hourly wage, you know, for how many hours. And I was like, I think this is where I go. <laughs> but she understood and like yeah. we're friends but and nice. then i was like i'm gonna go be a tiktoker bye damn so like what happens when like you talk to your family do they think you're fucking crazy because like yeah, our family hilarious. thinks oh, we're nuts no they, we're they, they, they think i'm ridiculous and like but you're like actually living off of it so like when you call like your mom <laughs> or your dad are you like yeah i paid rent and they're like how and you're like i damn yeah <laughs> <laughs> okay so actually when i first started making money off of live streams actually it was like I was making money, it wasn't when I first did, but like I came back during like when COVID happened. So I was mm-hmm. kind of just like hanging with family and stuff, but I would still go live. And then they were like, and then I was trying kind of trying to explain it. And they're like, so you do what? And <laughs> they send you money. And like my dad is just like, what the fuck? Like, and I'm like, no, I'm just 
Chill. I'm not in porn. And I'm like, I'm just yeah, literally yeah, it's, it's like, not porn. My clothes are on. I like because I paint custom sneakers, right? So yeah. a lot of the times when I'm streaming, I'll like be painting and streaming at the same time, and I just like I'm hanging out with yeah. my fans basically while right. painting, and it's entertaining or whatever. And I'm like, no, I'm just like chilling, or I'm like painting, and if they want to send gifts, they send gifts, and that is like real money or translates to real money, and. They it's gonna just, be such a weird concept so to weird. grasp. Yeah, that's like, yeah, yeah. like I like my mom is very much. She's like, go follow your dreams. And my dad was yeah. like, I mean, do whatever. Like, I you're not gonna listen to me anyways. But like, <laughs> yeah, if it's like, working. Like he's like, okay, but like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, yeah. I'm like, all right. The person that relates to me the most probably is my brother's daughter. She's my niece, and she's like. 14 or something Perfect so she's like time. gen z yeah, so she's like she's at the high school just hustling for yeah. you like yo check her yeah. out check her she's out she's like she'll like brag to her friends and her yeah. friends will be like like all of her friends follow me and they're like oh my god can you like uh, whatever they just get like really excited about like little things so they'll see mm. me hanging out with certain tiktokers uh, tiktokers and they'll like fangirl over it or something sure. because those are like who they look up to uh, and I also sometimes speak like you know how like Gen Z has their language, even though we're all millennials. Yeah. Sure. I like yeah. speak kind of like Gen Z because I'm in that world because TikTok is so like like a 14 year old, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll be like, no, I'll say things that like like she'll understand. And my yeah. sister, who's like my age, basically, like, she's like a year older than me, will be like, I remember. I, I, said, I was saying, she said something to me, and I was like, dead ass. And she was like, okay. dead ass? <laughs> I was like, yeah, dead ass. You took, like, the cool aunt to the yeah, next right? fucking level. Yeah. Yes. You're the fucking, like, <laughs> best friend aunt. 100%. That's, like, my goal. I'm like, I want to be, like, the coolest, coolest aunt. I'm going to, like, fly her out to, like, meet Charlie D'Amelio one of these days. There as soon go. as I meet her. Charlie, yeah. what's up? Hit me up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, I, like, I have a 14-year-old niece, too, and it's, like, it's insane that like TikTokers and just social, like whatever, social media influencers in general yeah. is like the new like celebrity or yeah. music artist or like actor. Like, you know, back when we were like 14 or 12, it was like Hanson or whatever the yeah. fuck, or, or NSYNC yeah. or, you know what I mean? Like you would yeah. fangirl over like yeah. artists mm -hmm. and shit. Now people fangirl over social media influencers yeah. instead, which is just like so strange. It, I know, it's such a weird world we live like, it's in. It's so weird. It's yeah. so weird. Like. My one of my best friends, and he's also um, one of my roommates, Dakota. He's a big TikToker, and he yeah. has blue hair, and he's in a lot of my like throwback videos, so people will know. I him. thought that was Ninja. No, I'm kidding. I know <laughs> that's what everybody says. And so he went to San Diego the other day, and he he skates. So he was at the skate park. He FaceTimes me, and he's like, "Hey." Uh, there's some fans here and then there's these kids and they're like, oh my, and they like, so he gets, every time we go out anywhere, kids get super excited about him and they're like, oh my God, it's a TikToker and they take photos with him and stuff. So, uh, they were like, <laughs> he was like, so you have some fans, they want to ask you to do something, but don't do it. And I was like, oh, I know what they're going to say. And so he like puts the camera on them and there's like this little group of like, they must've been like a bunch of like 12 year olds yeah. and they're like, throw it back, throw it back, throw it back. And I was like, oh my God. Dakota's like, no, we kind of like keep this thing going because yeah. if yeah. you've seen the videos, you understand. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, don't worry. They'll be playing throughout this entire <laughs> yeah. interview right here. So no, this is the, the guy thing. that smashes all the phones, right? Yeah. What the fuck <laughs> is that about? That's what I'm saying. It's crazy. So like he'll run up and just like, smash someone's phone in front of them and then like immediately replace the phone and, then give them, like, and he'll phone. get like 12 million views and shit yeah and it's just like I like to it's crazy. how do you like hack into like the mind of like well he was doing it for the, free just beforehand even not even filming it like, and then it's, it's, it's just, it's, yeah it's yeah. crazy that that specific like that's what he's known that's like his thing right like yeah. i feel like each one of the tiktokers has like a, a a thing that they, they carved to. out, yeah, and then like that's what they ride with, and that's what a hundred percent. Whereas like, and social sometimes media it happens or, by Insta's accident. not like that. What? Instagram's not really like that. No, you know, Instagram it's more, like, is so like how hot and like yeah, yeah and, like, and, like how exciting. Instagram's so 2019. It's yeah. literally so 2019. <laughs> <laughs> this is what people don't understand about TikTokers. It's like it's okay. Well, I'll I'll, I'll start with this. How nervous were you when they were like, "We're gonna ban TikTok"? Yeah. Um. <laughs> I was... How many followers were you at when they were about to do that? But when? They've done it like three times yeah. where we've had like this like TikTok banning scare. So it happened at different points. At one point, I think I had like 200 something thousand. It was already after I'd hit like my 100K mark. Yeah. And was this after you decided that you're going to do this full time? Yeah. So that's even scarier. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but Sorry. so I was like, 
I don't. I was. Nervous. Would you say? Would you say it's the equivalent of like people in Japan when they were doing the uh, like? There's gonna be a nuclear bomb like warnings like they go. <laughs> oh into my the desk, god! The things like that. Oh my god! That? What type of horrible person would be if I was like, yes, it was literally the equivalent <laughs> of that. You should see the other. <laughs> no, Actually, it was it not was the worse. equivalent of that. <laughs> yeah, it was, pretty pretty it was, similar. It was worse. <laughs> no, but it was like it was stressful. Yeah. Except that. Um, so my friend, the one that breaks the iPhones, he mm-hmm. has like a, a contact at TikTok. Um, and so he was just like, he was like, they're not banning it. And he's like, it's not going anywhere. Like he was so not phased by it that I was like, no, but you have to be prepared. And he was like, I mean, okay. And I was like, no, you have to like, yeah. you're yeah. you're stressing me out that you're not stressed out. And yeah. he was like, no, it's not going anywhere. And he was so certain. And then he was like, trust me. And I was like, all right. But I was still stressed out. I was... Uh, sending my followers to like subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I've also, um, I stream on Twitch as well. So I was kind of just trying to direct traffic. Like <laughs> You got to diversify. But yeah. I also, you know, I was, you know, it's not like I, this is new for me. So I was still surviving before TikTok. So I wasn't like, I'm going to like go broke, go broke and yeah, die yeah. and mm-hmm. like live on the streets if I, if I like t- TikTok goes away. But yeah. it was more like I would have been really sad because TikTok makes me happy. Yeah. <laughs> <That makes laughs> it does. I love and I love my TikTok community. Like I have some like dope ass fans. They're like yeah. the most hardcore. Yeah. Like well, exactly. That's exactly what. So I was what I was gonna say was people don't realize that TikTokers and back to Ryan's point, it's just becoming like the new celebrity where yeah. you know you could have a huge celebrity in the gym. Like I don't know tick whatever N- NBA basketball player. Yeah. But all of a sudden you see a TikToker come in and it's like that's where the kids flock to. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. So which is like it's it's a weird concept, but it's like. That's what it is, mm-hmm. you know. Yeah. So because it's, like, it's, it's your phone. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like before, it was your TV. So like yeah. anything that was on your TV was super dope, and then it kind of crossed into your computer. And there's like anything mm-hmm. that's cool on the computer and TV is super dope. Now it's whatever the fuck is cool on, on your phone, phone yeah. is gonna be what's cool. Literally. And this is all. That's all. It even is, even right? when you watch Netflix and shit like that, what else yeah. are you doing? Yeah. You're yeah. also on your phone. Through, yeah. Hundred percent. Like, and you're barely watching Netflix. And the new generation, <laughs> like, true. yeah. <laughs> You know what I mean? Like, how many times have you put a show on and been like, I heard three words in yeah. this entire show. <laughs> yeah. I've yeah. just been staring at my exactly. phone. Exactly. But, like, yeah, the Addison Rays of the world, like, they're the new, like, defining what, what Hollywood's going to be, especially Absolutely. now that they're casting them in movies and stuff like I that. I know. Yeah, so. it's working back to them now. Now yeah. it's like, oh, you're going to be in the next movie. It's, it's like... Cr- it's crazy. It's actually, like, so weird. Well, now yeah. they're like... And even, like, um, I just saw BB Rexa posted this on her on you know bb rexa she's yeah. like yeah like an artist she posted a tiktok where it's like a part of her new music video for her new song but like charlie d'amelio is like featured in it yeah. and so like it's like they're wiz khalifa and yeah, fucking yeah, yeah. j cole or something and, you know, like, yeah but it's just funny because it's like the people on tiktok are probably like more of them are probably like who the hell is bb rexa and mm-hmm. you, you yeah. know what i mean where yeah. it's like they are now going to you like having to use the tiktokers to like yeah. I'm not saying, okay, I love BB Rexa, so no shade, BB. But, like, you know what I mean? Just to, like, keep the relevance yeah, for, yeah. like, that whole audience. Well, dude, how smart into. is Jason Derulo? Oh, my God, he's a genius. genius. I genius. was just talking about this today. Mm-hmm. Like, he was one of the artists that was, like, just fucking brilliant when TikTok started blowing up. Yeah. Like, like whatever, at the beginning of this year. And other artists didn't or they like well, yeah, they laugh it at it and they're like that. oh my god it's 14 year old yeah. kids it's no. like those 14 year old kids are like, gonna be the next like consumers in the next 20 years yeah. exactly. they're gonna That's be buying shit from you in four years yeah. oh my god i've had this i've been having this conversation thank you no preach <laughs> we're on your side you guys like, are from florida yeah. Yeah. no but for real like i've had yeah. this conversation even when i was on it i was like yo my friends think i'm cringy and i was like what friends <laughs> like, yeah. whatever i'm just gonna do it anyways i've all, i've just been kind of like that person that's yeah. like, i'm gonna do it do whatever i want because i give no fucks but i definitely had people that I know or close friends or even like even if they weren't saying it openly to me I just knew a lot of people that you, you know it. from my hometown well, or whatever that are oh, like yeah. they think TikTok is cringy they think all the videos are cr- like yeah. you know what I mean and I yeah. was like and for a while I actually like didn't share anything on Instagram because I was kind of like I don't know I don't want to be like judged yeah, yeah. or like sense. and then now I you gotta put yourself care. out there yeah, yeah. Yeah. It was hard for us at first. Like, it's like we make ourselves look like an idiot for an hour a week. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah, but so sometimes, I mean, sometimes when you, it's when what you, you make do. the videos, do you ever feel like embarrassed while you're doing them or are you just kind of like full send? Like, no, I'm page? just full send. I don't <laughs> <laughs> care. Yeah, like, yeah. she does have pink hair. Yeah. So. yeah. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. I, I do. Yeah. This We're was for this. hitting 50K. Yeah. That, oh. that was like a game I played with my followers when I, like, nice. before I, I was like, if I hit 50K, I'll do something crazy. And then that, like, we kind of just decide these things together. So yeah. in like live streams yeah. and stuff, and they're yeah. like, dye your hair, like this color, that color. And then we kind of decided on pink. 
So when I hit 50K. There you go. Yeah, so happened. when we hit 1K, and not just stuff. We're, uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm dyeing my hair blue. Yeah. Do it. Do you think I should do it? Because, like, I don't have, like, much. Like, I don't have, like, cute I think you hair, should have like, a color that, if you do dye it, mm-hmm. that, like, Talk to me. will contrast. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to my advice. It's just contrast your eyes to make them pop. Okay, well, so I mean, I have gorgeous blue, blue eyes. So, so don't so, make them, oh, bl- don't make your hair blue. That was my biggest mistake. I always thought the blue on blue. Yeah. No. I, mm, okay, so think what color Think of the color wheel. What is opposite to blue on the color wheel? We got bright blue nails, pink hair. Come on, Tim, pick up on it. Okay, dude. so She's I have... all, like you got to make it blow up on the. Camera. Okay, it's so what color hair pop. are we talking? Yeah, like it's gonna either it's hmm. gonna have to be like I'm thinking some Takashi orange, <laughs> like a like a <laughs> bright like Just I would do like a orange. bright orange. Oh yeah, like yeah, a become, fiery orange. Yeah, become a redhead. <laughs> yeah, it's, <laughs> you don't have a soul. That's what I've always advised ever. Yeah, are you tra- wait? Are you fucking with me? <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> like, <laughs> 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 do it, pussy. Yeah, fall for that one, loser. Do it so. like fuchsia, magenta. <laughs> well, you know, some of my dye. I have a lot of mm. big hair dye. Dude, the the next move, like to your point about Jason Derulo, though, yeah. is the OnlyFans tip. Oh. That's where they're. That's the next fucking next move. Step. Have you seen this shit? Hmm. Pe- people are making like all the celebrities are deciding to do like like mm-hmm. ma- mainly the dudes that don't give a fuck. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They're just like dropping drawers on OnlyFans and making a shit ton of money. Yeah. Well, I mean, I don't know if I would. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if that's the segue we're going here. Well, for. think about it. Jason Derulo's like, I'll do funny TikToks, and then he did his OnlyFans and showed his that. dick. Jason Derulo has an OnlyFans. He showed his no, dick on. O- Wait, what? Yeah. And it's it about Jason Derulo or Tyga. No, Tyga's also on OnlyFans. Because <laughs> I knew Tyga. No, Tyga's but do you think? But do you, okay, so I know that Cardi B also made one too. Yeah. Really? Do you think that oh, yeah, these were making... like? Uh, do you think OnlyFans paid them to do it to, to get that's more people? Wow! Perfect. And they're I gonna get they paid did. from their. You're fucking, way smarter than all of us. That's, way, that's a great too. idea. Yeah. I think yeah. that's. Oh yeah, no, I'm not that smart, right? Bella what do you want from me? Exactly. I think they saw the dollar signs. Yeah, actually, good point. Because that was that happened shortly before. That would be such a great PR move on their point to have to pay Cardi B. Dude, Cardi's naked in every music video ever. Why not get paid for it? Exactly. Yeah. I mean, she does get paid for, but but I get what <laughs> get you're saying. Why like, do you get paid again? She does again. make a good amount of money from get all paid of for that. The music like, and good the point, Ryan. Yeah. Make, yeah. The, make so. the same video and get paid for it twice. So what's going on with you once you break one million? What's the, uh, what's the big deal there? Oh my God, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, you're almost there. You gotta think about it. I know. I do need to think about it. Um, Dye your hair orange. <laughs> <laughs> Go back to five hundred thousand. Um. Yeah, I actually probably should figure something out really cool because I don't know. All right. Well, I do know that there's a pair of sneakers, custom sneakers that are waiting for me that I have that. Okay, so my friend Dakota, he also does custom. He doesn't really. Yeah. He just kind of does them when he wants to. <laughs> um, but he started a pair of custom sneakers, probably anticipating that I would hit a million sooner. And so they're You're Air disappointed Force ones. him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I failed him <laughs> for sure. They, they're just now like in the box, 100. percent They're just like kind of chilling in the closet. But like I've already seen them, and they're in progress. And they like they say like one mil, and then like TikTok, and that has like my at, and they're super sick. Damn, that sounds so. Awesome. Awesome. They're yeah. waiting for me. I don't know. Maybe he shouldn't have shown them to me before. He well, you brought finished. a pair here today, right? Can we check them out? Oh yeah, these. Um, <laughs> you want to see my what? You want to see my what? Oh, oh shit. shit! So I'm. They're not done. Well, they're basically done. I have to clear coat them. Um, but this is. That's tight. These are actually for someone. So. Those are dope. If anybody, if they're watching. How, how this, long would you say like one pair takes you? I wish I could give you like a straight answer. <laughs> yeah, all I've, different. Uh, yeah, it depends on the design. I've been pretty horrible lately just because we had to move and everything so i got i got a bunch of orders and then we and then i got super busy and i was yeah. like oh my god i'm sorry but like if i just focus and i just do like from start to finish mm, i don't think i can still give you a straight answer but maybe like <laughs> i don't know like maybe just like i could probably do probably it probably like, depends on day. each shoe right and it depends on the shoe yeah like, like how hard you're gonna go wait, and... my question is when did you like start painting shoes and getting into that yeah it's pretty cool last year Damn. Um, did you paint beforehand or like I've always let me put this down before I. Because Keith still can't like color within the lines. No, no, no. <laughs> Did you say Keith still can't color? I can't. No. The, yeah. It's okay. Uh, you just one day. Pick okay. it out, huh? Mm. We'll color for you. Stepping stones. <laughs> <laughs> we'll uh, you. You stepping stones or Rosetta Stone? Yeah. <laughs> stepping stones. <laughs> Coloring books help. Um, yeah. yeah. So I'm a big fan of sneakers. Like I have an obsession with sneakers. Nice. In general. And then I also am into art. Like I've always loved art, whether it's like painting or sketching or just like making anything. 
I mean, I used to also do like random things like build stages and paint cars and motorcycles. So I have like a lot of background in just like the arts in general. Mm -hmm. So last year I was like, I should combine like my love for sneakers and painting and paint custom sneakers. Dope. So that's basically what I did. I just like kind of YouTube some things, bought a bunch of paint. I also already know how to finish leather. And so it's kind of like the same, you use a lot of the similar paint and the same right. technique. So it wasn't like something new for me, except that it was new because it was like on a shoe instead of like yeah. a couch or something. But so I just basically started. That's yeah. cool. That's pretty sick. And you do them like live on Twitch? Like, so what's the deal with Twitch? How did you get yeah. this going on Twitch? Okay, right. so my roommate. What do you play on Twitch? Yeah. First of all, if you say fucking Call of Duty, I swear to God. Yeah, what's your KD? Yeah. <laughs> Don't fuck around. <laughs> I love Fortnite. Oh. I love Fortnite. You know how I know you're gay? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, what? What? <laughs> no, tell me about Fortnite. I, I love, love Fortnite, yeah, but also nice. I feel like I'm this, like Fortnite's been around. Oh yeah. I played Fortnite for the first time like a month ago. Oh, and you're um, hooked? You're I love it. I'm obsessed. <laughs> I'm like, it's so fun. It's just so fun. Nice. And I'm like building things and like All shooting, your followers protect you. Trying to like yeah. run oh, from the storm. Like, that's the best part about every like famous girl yeah. going online to Twitch oh is they, they don't ever die because everyone protects them. Yeah. And I mean, just it like, depends. She's like, no, I get fucked. No, I die for sure. <laughs> yeah, I get roasted. If I'm playing like with them, like you can play like different, like creative play or whatever. I'm still like learning. I'm such a fucking mm. noob. But um, <laughs> nice. I did play with my fans and it was super fun because they were like, and like, you know, you can like hear them all and they're like, Ariel, Ariel, I'll protect you. And they're like, I'll be your bodyguard. And then there was, I had like four of them just build. And these kids were like, I'm like, you're so fucking good. How are you so good? I'm so Insane. bad at building. I'm yeah. like, one, two, one, like, I'm so bad at building. It's like sad, but I will get better. Yeah. Um, Have you won in Fortnite game yet? Of course. Oh, uh, whoa, okay. Like so a victory much. royale. Oh, yes. Excuse oh, wow. For sure. <laughs> <laughs> But like not by myself, like with like. <laughs> oh, yeah. no, you carry, know, but, carry. Like, Yeah, we'll play duos or squads. Yeah. Um, yeah, for sure. Well, you gotta you gotta play us in Among Us. We have to have a crossover Ooh, yes. game. Yes. Yeah. We, we talked about Among Us. Dang, on the game. I pink am sus as fuck. Pink is so <laughs> sus. We're voting you out right away. Yeah. Okay. I'm really Bang. good. You. I'm you? so. <laughs> So you're a sociopath. <laughs> yeah. We all talk about it, like whoever's really good is a really good liar. Yeah, it's just, I'm know. really good at the game too. Okay, and no, like, okay, to be honest, so I didn't know the first time I was an imposter, I didn't know. I felt no. so dumb. What's this fun do? <laughs> no, I didn't know that you could only vent if you were an imposter. Yeah. And so I was playing with just, one of my roommates and I was also playing with my fans but on we were on live stream. So I had like my fans, the one, there was a couple of them in the stream watching, and then he was like right next to me, but we couldn't see each other's screens. So mm. I was an imposter, and I was like pretending like I had to do tasks and whatever. And then I was like, and then I was like, oh, I can vent. And I was like, I'm gonna go in the vent. And then I thought everybody could go in the vent. Yeah. And then he's like, Rookie emergency mistake. meeting. And he's like, <laughs> Ariel's the imposter. She just vented. <laughs> and then everybody on my live stream was like. Ariel's the imposter. They're all calling me yeah, out. Yeah, and I was yeah. like, uh, yeah. The best is when someone so obviously get, gets called out and you see them try to defend themselves yeah. and just oh, go yeah. down That's in why flames. If, if someone yeah. sees you vent and they get to the emergency meeting, you have to beat them in the chat first. Yeah. You just have to be like, yellow fucking vented. And they're yeah. like, what? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's so such a, you yeah. just have to beat but them to the chat. I was on stream and right next to him. So I was like, rat, I was like, oh, yeah. it wasn't me. He saw me. I said that out loud. I was like, oh, I can go in the vent. And I like went in the vent. Yeah. But I said it. Yeah. So I had like all these witnesses. They were like, yo, Ariel, like that's <laughs> no, yeah. that's not yeah. 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 And I was like, oh my God. That's not how you play. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So hold on. I, we have a couple more TikToks that I still have oh. questions about over yeah. here. Let's, let's see how you, you get to 800,000. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So my biggest question is, do you, okay. This TikTok in number one, let's check it out. Oh, okay. Oh, that was in South Africa. Oh, was it? In the gym. Oh, I was in the gym. Okay. So this is my question, though. Yeah. Do you ever get embarrassed, like, when you're doing TikToks in public? And, like, how does that work? Dude, I don't what? think it bothers her at all. It doesn't, <laughs> it doesn't bother me. I do TikToks in public. I... Do, you, do you walk around the house just fucking going, like, I'm getting my what milk, getting my cereal, and just fucking... Sometimes, suck, yeah. Suck, suck. Yeah. To be honest. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's probably Sometimes. got... It's, like, ingrained. But it depends on, like, whichever song is like whichever tiktok dance maybe mm -hmm. is like 
trending or that's like running through my mind if i sure. just learned one then i'll like usually be kind of like doing it like you know okay so there was the just savage the which was yeah. huge and then savage remix and then there was a dance for that one and i remember actually i did like three tiktoks with that dance and then that was like also when i like hit the 100k mark but that one like anytime i would hear that song it was just like I'm a sad. no, I would just start, just doing, start the, doing it. Yeah. I would just start doing the TikTok. <laughs> that makes sense though. And I'd be like, like before TikTok, all this shit, put like... on dance, all my demons. You know, like I was just like <laughs> yeah. going to it. I'd be like, mm. then just like, like teach me how to Dougie. Yeah. Like we were doing that shit too. We just you just didn't. Film only it. you loser. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> So yeah, I kind of do have TikTok audios going through my head. Like you get used to the audios, and so like. You, friends that are on TikTok, you can relate to. So, like, we'll do this around the house because I live in a creator house, so we're all TikTokers. Mm -hmm. And so, like, if someone, for example, you guys might not get this, but someone's just like, yeah, I don't understand, then another one will be like, I don't understand. And, we'll all, and then we'll all be like, bitch, I don't understand. Because that's a TikTok audio yeah. that yeah, was, yeah, like, yeah. you know, a trend. Like, we're, we're, we're hip as the kids say. I don't say. know if you're that hip. I don't know. I didn't know. Back in my day, <laughs> we had the soldier boy. <laughs> so, like, there's all these, like, different sounds. So, like, don't be shy. Put some or, you know, yeah, yeah, that, yeah. or you don't know, it's okay. We, yeah, yeah, we, we saw that. We saw that one. Talks, right? okay. okay, hit me with one. Savage love. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. I'm gonna go kill myself. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. No. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was, okay. I was just vibing okay. with you real quick. So you're, all, you're also a uh, like a social media coach too, right? Like, don't you have programs and you work with people as well? Or? Uh, I used to do that actually. I was doing that like last year, okay. and I was doing like mentorships, yeah. and then I created an, in a, like a I can't talk an online course, an Instagram course actually. It's like a whole video course. Okay. Yeah. I actually spent a lot of time doing that, and it's like fucking solid. Uh, so it's still there. I just need but you're to... just so busy with your own shit right now. No, I'm like, so busy that like yeah. I genuinely like forget that I spent all that time and like long nights like editing and whatever doing that and putting that together. But it does exist. Um, what would you say for a baby TikToker like myself? Oh. Um, mm. Any advice? How do you uh, how do you become successful on the talk of Tik? Okay. Mm. Oh my God. <laughs> wow. That's what the kids are saying, right? It's just what all the kids are on doing. the talk of Tik. Well. Um, if you had to give someone like a, a point of advice, like what would be a good helpful hint to like get your shit going? Mm, so many things, but I would say this is this is also like cliche, but it's not, so it's okay. Um, do like be yourself one, like just be yourself, unless that doesn't work. Then be someone else. <laughs> unless you hate yourself, <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> unless you realize you're a loser, you should probably yeah, switch it up a little bit. Unless you're a piece of shit and try harder. <laughs> that, that's the exact advice the dating coach gave too. It was like, just be yourself, and we'll like, unless you're a horrible person, then don't do that. It's hilarious. No, but like, um, it is like sometimes like with TikTok is so interesting because you never know when like a video is gonna pop off, and sometimes yeah. like less is more like if you like don't overthink things have fun with the app but also once you kind of find like what works or what your audience likes then figure out how to get more creative or like along that line yeah um that makes sense like kind of find your crew like your your audience that goes with you yeah. and then kind of like build it off that yeah and i know a lot of it's collaboration right isn't it a lot of it based on like if you can get someone else that's really big too and then you guys can work together doesn't that help a ton that or? helps of course that definitely helps like yeah. for sure because then you're sharing audiences right. and you're showing like new people mm -hmm. you know new creators and stuff um but also like you want to be able to be somebody if that person is out of the picture still definitely so don't yeah. like rely on that um, just, just lean on every famous person <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, exactly yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah just hop around just to like everyone else's clout hopping like clout hopping <laughs> yeah. cloud not clout oh. chasing but clout hopping i like that she's I really involved these days fucking cloud hoppers you just have like oh. my throwback video just on a loop right so now. i was gonna say did you that, did you really start this trend? so that was the video that like was like Hit oh. like millions of views. Nice. And that was like where like the whole throwback thing started because it was just like, it was around when Savage was like that video and everyone was throwing it back. Yeah. And I was even making fun of the throw it back on TikTok because I was like, yo, these girls are like lifting up this knee doing this horse move. Like, what is? Hi, look at these losers. No. So, but now it's like, <laughs> no, but now yeah. and then it became a thing where when we did it, he was like. 
we're just like I'm gonna do it like ridiculous. I'm just gonna like do like my leg up and yeah, just make it look exaggerate ridiculous. Exaggerate the shit out of it. Yeah. Yeah, and so <laughs> <laughs> it worked. They loved it. They <laughs> love it. And now like every it's provocative. Time... It gets the people, people going. Go. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, now they're just like throw it back. Damn. How was it when you had like the first brand like approach you? Like how did? Because it's not like a is it a DM even in tic, the talk of ticks? The <laughs> so slide through the like tickety talk campaign. It'll come okay. through like Instagram or email. Got you. Um, or mm. so how was it when you had that first one like come through? Like were you like oh damn this is dope? Or so like, actually on like uh, promos on TikTok a lot of them are just for because it's like a music app. So the, yeah. a lot of artists that create music get really big on TikTok because their audios or their songs basically get used for different trends or different sure, dances yeah, or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Dude, PP cocaine. So what? What? Do Sorry. you know that chick? No. What? Who? You don't. No oh, god, I know. You don't know PP cocaine? No. Yeah, the Three know. Musketeers. I'm sure. I'm sure you don't you know do. that song? Oh. P. P. Wait, yeah. the Three Musketeers. Mm-hmm. Hey, hey, show you me. I'm trying to blow her back. I know the whole dance. Yes. Oh, I know. <laughs> how do you? How do you? It's so crazy. Yeah. This was so crazy. They're like they so know the songs, but out. like here again. Exactly. She knows the whole dance, doesn't know the guy's name yeah. or the girl's <laughs> name. Yeah. Okay, but wait, song. I thought that her name was something else. God. Nope, it's PP Cocaine. PP Cocaine, yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I was literally like, uh, uh, what? Like, what did yeah. you just say? I'm sorry. So, oh, sorry, get your TikTok game up. I fucking okay. love that song, though, honestly. <laughs> it's pretty good. I love it. It's like, it's so catchy. I've, like, done a couple TikToks to that. Have you ever been, like, recognized in public yet? Like, how, or how did that feel the first time it happened? So it happens, like... It happened at like Target the other day, and oh, that was so funny actually. It happened at Venice Beach a lot when I go there because there's always tons of people, sure. or like Santa Monica and stuff. Um, or I've had people in my live stream be like, "I saw you at the." They'll say like a specific location. What Someone the said fuck? I was at uh, IKEA, like, and uh, I didn't put it on my story or anything. And then I had someone on my live stream. They were like, "I saw you at IKEA on Sunday," and I was like, "Dang! Next time, say hi." Like, yeah, that's so the? weird. But um, probably this one time at Target, this kid like came up to me in the parking lot and he walked up to me and it was funny because like I'm used to people recognizing Dakota if we're out in public mm -hmm. but he comes up to me and then he was like are you the one that throws it back and then mm -hmm. that guy always gets mad and then he jumps in the pool because we have like one TikTok where he mm -hmm. like it's, he jumps in the pool whatever yeah. and it was just so funny because this kid was like 12 years old so <laughs> and he just like his little voice was like are you the one that throws it <laughs> yeah. back and he gets mad and I was like <laughs> Yes. That's me. That's me. And he was like, <laughs> How you doing? And then like the next question is always, it's either, can I take a picture or can you follow me on TikTok? <laughs> it's Aww. really yeah. the cutest thing. And I'm like, yeah. okay, I'll follow you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's cool. That's so awesome. I guess the real question is, so where do we go from here? Yeah, what's next? Like from here, my career. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> career what's, what's like your next? Yeah. What's your next goal? Social media wise, yeah. um, you want to hit like a million, nine hundred, eight hundred? Like what's I want to like hit a million. Okay, like a million, so million, I need to hit million, that million. million. Because I just want like That's an crazy. M. That's yeah. crazy. Which is gonna be crazy. It's such a That's game changer. Cool. Like I, when you when it's like one M, you're like, oh fuck. Yeah. <laughs> so That's how I'm gonna feel and be like, what? Even yeah. though it is at the end of the day just a number, but it's actually like also real oh. people that like fuck with me, and I'm like, yeah. you people are awesome. So I'm excited about that. Um, I want a little check mark. Hopefully, TikTok thinks I'm like verifiable. True. Mm. Well, thank you so much yeah. for coming on our episode. <laughs> you thank are you for awesome. Me. Uh, make sure to check her out. All her social media will be down here. Oh yeah. Um, thank you guys for joining us. Make sure to like, subscribe, leave a comment, let us know what you think, and uh, we'll see you guys in the next episode. Sounds good. Peace. Bye.